Hey, Charles. Next on the list. I'm trying. Evening, gentlemen. <laughs> Charming. <laughs> oh, peace, Charles. He'll grow on you. Oi! Catherine, you fussock! Get back here! Daddy needs a drink! What? The? That just went flying. How fares the search? Maths and maps are not cutting it. What if your local contacts? We'll need to earn their trust before they'll share what they know. <sighs> oh, I have an idea on how we might be affecting that. There's a man who's taken to enslaving natives. Rescue them, and they'll owe us. <laughs> Do you know where they're being held? Afraid not. Benjamin Church will. He's a finder and a fixer. He's also on your list. And there I was, wondering whom I might solicit next. Well done. <laughs> oh, you are such a kiss-ass. Let's go do it. You gonna have anything new to say? Or, now all you're sitting at this table. Got no office to give at current. When I do, you'll be the first to hear it. Sure I would be. Do you like it here, Charles? There's a certain charm to Boston, I suppose. To all of the colonies, really. Granted, their cities have none of London's sophistication or splendor, but the people are earnest and hardworking. They've a pioneer spirit I find compelling. It's quite something, really, watching a place that's finally found its feet. Has it, though? The French still wage war from up north, and I fear the Spanish have designs upon this place as well. Is this a new world, or just another battlefield? The latter. Ah, that's a story old as time itself. And one that's not like to change. We're cruel and desperate creatures set in our conquering ways. The Saxons and the Franks, the Ottomans and Safavids. I could go on for hours. The whole of human history is but a series of conflicts and subjugations. A desire for more and more and more. I pray one day we rise above it. Whilst you pray, I'll act. We'll see who finds success first, hmm? It was an expression. Aye. And a dangerous one. Words have power. Wield them wisely. Uh, boop. This business with Silas confuses me. Oh. If Britain stands any chance of pushing back the French, they must ally with the natives. Not enslave them. Silas is loyal only to his purse. That his actions harm the crown is irrelevant. So long as there are buyers for his product, he'll continue to procure it. All the more reason to stop him, then. My days are spent in Congress with the locals, attempting to convince them that we're the ones they should trust, that the French are merely using them as tools to be abandoned once they've won. Your words must lose their strength when held against the reality of Silas' actions. I've tried to explain that he does not represent us. But he wears the red coat. He commands a fort. I must appear to them either a liar or a fool. Likely both. Take heart, brother. When we deliver them his head, they'll know your words were true. And then proven false by, you know, the actual government. Oh, yay, colonization. <laughs> okay, let's head out. Very... Very slowly. So slowly. I don't know why it's bugging me so much today. <laughs> Probably shouldn't. Um, oh, you're out here now. Did I teleport again? You need to stop teleporting me, game. <laughs> uh, the house was built in 1707 by a prominent local merchant named Robert Caliph. Benjamin Church bought it, he bought it here for from his heirs to use as a Boston residence. Church's practice is on Newbury Street, fairly short walk away, so the house was in, in, a, in an ideal location. It's also in a nice part of town. Even the colonial Boston two-story houses with fenced and gardens that don't come cheap, and they didn't even get cable. Actually, given the location, it seems that Church's practice was doing very well indeed. That, or he had another source of revenue. Um, did I not read this? Uh, no I didn't. Old meeting house bells in this church rang out in the hours leading out up to the Boston Massacre, uh, crowds were gathering to taunt the soldiers in front of the state's house. In Boston at the time, church bells were rung when there was a fire, so people ran to the streets to see what was happening. That swell, 
the crowd make contentions between the people and the British soldiers that much worse. And, of course, with the soldiers firing into the crowd, killing five people. And this concludes our lesson how church bells could be used to incite riots in colonial America. <laughs> That logically makes sense. Sup? What you got for me? Don't break the door open. Wonderful. <laughs> Shut <Charles>. up. <laughs> Sir? Okay. <laughs> sure. Ooh. Seems like we're not the early ones looking for Mr. Church. Damn it, he could be anywhere. What do we do? Clues. We find him. With the painting? <laughs> it's just Brian walk around like, have you seen this man? Come. D <laughs> I'll show you how. It would have been much better if we literally just walked around with the entire portrait. It's like, have you seen this man? Can I not go into the house? Oh, There was blood on the ground. Non lethal weapons. Orange markers indicate caution. These targets must not, must not be killed. Benjamin Church. Uh, Benjamin Church was a talented physician and essentially the first Surgeon General of the U.S. Army. Church was born in Rhode... Oh, born in 1734. Born in Rhode Island and graduated from Harvard University in 1754. So you're meeting him here just out of college. He'd be appointed head of the medical wing of the Continental Army in 1775, but for God's sake don't tell him, it'll go straight to his head. Church goes on to become a vocal patriot, which makes him sound like a member of the weird barbershop quartet. But he was a member of the Sons of Liberty and his local committee of correspondence. He'll even speak at the third anniversary of the Boston Massacre. Ma massacre. He's also got a house in a very nice part of town. Being a doctor must pay well. Boop. Boop. So we're going to eavesdrop and not kill people. Should we write his family, do you think? Not our business to meddle, even if we've the best of intentions. But if you could have seen it, they were surely drunk carrying on like that, and during the day, no less. If you've a problem, needs attending to. Jack Fredericks is your man. Discreet, efficient, and cheap. I literally cannot move, game. Like, game. Oh, there you go. Now you're letting me move. Move between the two civilians? Like this? Yeah. I was gonna say, what are you, what are you trying to make me do? It's like, walk between the two civilians. Like, okay, I'm gonna walk between two civilians. Why did I pull my sword out on them? Well, see, you weren't really letting me walk for a bit, so... That didn't help. Okay, sure. Sure, game. Non lethal markers, got it. Or non lethal weapons. Stay close to the targets here are the pieces of information you need. SAI social status and care indicates your enemy's detection or investigation state. During the day, no less. And the SAI fills with yellow means the target is suspicious. Once it's filled, the meter becomes red and starts an investigation. Move between the two civilians. London. The Boston Country Journal. One penny goes a long way. Oh, I see. Scandalous That's what you meant by two civilians. Who aims to be a surgeon? Not likely. If he keeps up such carousing. Truly a shameful display. Benjamin's parents would be mortified. Perhaps I should send someone to retrieve him before he damages his reputation beyond repair. They stumbled off to the northeast. No doubt in search of a tavern or some other place of ill repute. Start questioning those on the street. I'm headed for higher ground. Your mini ma map and me map revealed as you explore your environment. Climb to increase the rate of revelation. Oh! Oh! That's kind of a cool idea. Come on. 
So, the higher you are, the... Oh! So we're doing viewpoints. Got it. Um, oh, there's some British people over there. Um, not just the British person I am controlling. Whoa! I can c Yep, I won't- I don't blame you, guy just climbing on the flagpole. Don't know why I can climb on the flagpole, but I can see why that would be suspicious. Okay, how do I grab again? Because I think they changed that. Okay, game. Why? Oh, is that my controller that's just acting up? That won't surprise me. Um, definitely has not been a day for a... Uh... Oh, hello! Sorry, didn't mean to do that. I think climb the church. Yes. Okay. Okay, controller, why are you acting like the battery's dead? I literally changed the battery not even an hour ago. This is not gonna work. A little bit. Don't mind me. Ah, how do I climb up this building? That was fancy. There we go. Okay, can you actually climb up? Climb up. Thank you. Then, oh, nice little door. So it's not that suspicious that I'm, well, I'm kind of, it is suspicious that I'm climbing the side of the building, but I thought it wouldn't be that suspicious that I'm on the roof, per se. Oh, why? 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 Why did you do that? I... Uh, starting early, aren't we, game? This is how it's gonna be? Really? Oh. Screw you, game. Okay. Climb the window. Go up. Good game. Okay. This has not been the best of sessions. Oh well. Okay. Run, 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 and. It's fine. It's fine, guards. What's the worst that's gonna happen? That I break through the roof? Okay, it's that roof over there. Um, I might actually have to do that, because I don't think I'm gonna make it. No, not without. Why are you acting up controller like you're about to die? You literally have no reason for that. I just changed the battery to like brand new batteries. Hello. Ruffian, if you insist, I'll fetch the guard. Yep, you might want to, because I am uh, not the most savory of people. So, yeah, they have a balcony of sorts. I guess it's not that weird. And a door, so I guess it's not that weird for people to be up on this roof. Okay, come on. Don't be a butt this time. Maybe if I don't, just don't hold down the jump button. There we go. Come on, game. Uh, reaching high vantage points helps reveal the map and locate points of interest. Pass B to viewer synchronization. That is impressive. That is very impressive, mate. Because your foot's when your foot's Time just floating. Take a listen. With luck, one of those people knows what became of Benjamin. Um, what was my quest marker? Is that... What? Not what I wanted? <laughs> Eavesdrop on moving groups of crowds, do not know. 
Okay, where do I see my current objectives? Um... Quit. Start memory, leave animus, reload, resume. That's not telling me. Is this? Recent entries. Now it's just this building, but whatever. New South Ming House. Another wooden church, this time with a bell in the steeple. Samuel Adams' father, also named Samuel Adams, was one of the founding members. I'm surprised it wasn't torn down for firewood during the siege, but I guess its members just hadn't angered the British enough for that. It conveniently named so you wouldn't, won't mistake it for the old South Meeting Hall's house, where all the important events happen. Simple as best. I'm describing the name system. I'm not describing you. Um. Okay. And do not fail a single eavesdrop. Oh. There you go. Yay! Use clues to to look at target. Clues to take different. Sure. Someone on the other side of the building. Um. So any? None of them are in this immediate area, so I have to head like over here, I'm guessing. Okay. There we go. but they all plead ignorance. Look at that! They're lying. Aye. Well, what can I do? Threats light off them, and I'll not deign to grovel. Actions speak louder than words, my friend. Arrest one and put him in stocks. See if he's so glib then. To do so without cause will set them singing songs about us. Last thing the city needs is town criers complaining about our abuse of authority. And forget it. The crime is done. The killer's gone. Those who know won't share their secrets. If the city wishes to harbor scoundrels, let them pay the price for it. Analyze the clues to reduce the location. What do you mean by that? Honestly. Okay, game. You are not being the most simple of things. Okay, get off. You are a very chill horse. You know that game? Ooh, what's with the weird lens? <gasps> Hello. For clues. Dude, what do you mean by that? Like, this is the closest thing I can think of, but... What am I even doing? Um... Okay. I like, as much as I like having, hey, here's a sequence thing, I want to know, like, what I'm doing at this very second. These drops do not fail. Okay, why am I running around in this area, though? There you go. Um, between two people, so I'm guessing over here. I asked if I could help, and they waved me away. Insisted it was all under control. How odd. Did they say what had happened? No. Only that it was a trifling matter, and he'd be returned home soon. There was some blood, though, so I wonder if it wasn't more serious than they let on. Where were they taking him? Towards the hilltop. Perhaps there's a doctor at the fort. Um... Okay. What is oh viewpoint probably? Can I have to do that another day. So he says to church, but one way or another, the debt would be settled. I don't envy the man. He's green times ahead. Well, what do you think they're planning? All I know is it can't be good. Probably looking for a nice, quiet place to do the deed. From what I hear tell, his work usually involves quite a bit of screaming. Which reminds me, we'd best not buy any meat. <laughs> Good call, that. If you're not 
Okay. How many lead to the waterfront? A high lead. See, Charles? We'll have church in no time. Just as I said we would. If I might ask, sir, where did you learn to do all this? It is a requirement when you are raised in the manner that I was. Perception is fundamental to the order. It guides the feet when running and climbing, informs the hands when striking and fighting. But most important, it transforms the senses, and we begin to know the world in a different way. Can I just... Oh. Cool. I was wondering what that was. <laughs> 